November of last year. Oh, so sorry, Bill, your ass, bro. Chuck, we are wonderful people, but y'all so y'all definitely still some manipulators. Those some narcissistic narcissistic manipulators. Y'all really are. Not all of you. Not all of you. Trust me, not all of you. Not all of you. <laughs> but um I like to give some of the reasons why why people in the MBTI community said I wasn't an INFJ. Um, before disclosure, before I uh, go into the made up reasons they had, because I don't know, that's who they are. Now, you know, I, I found out I was an INFJ in November of last year. Um, and what I mean, I did research about this whole MBTI thing. Um, from November of last year to now, I watch over 4,000 videos of MBTI, not just INFJ. So you could imagine 4,000 videos and then me thinking on top of that. So what, so what, so when I tell you, I do not give a fuck. I do not give a single fuck if you don't think I'm an INFJ. I mean, I'm I'm not gonna tell you. I'm not gonna straight up be rude to you, but I'm telling you, I don't give a fuck because I watch over four thousand MBTI videos. I re I did over weeks of thinking, internal thinking. Oh, I wasn't really. I mean, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll just explain thinking. I kind of like to take all that information, just toss it in the air, and it just floats around until it comes to a piece. And those pieces became said INFJ. It, it it pretty it pretty much that simple. I have no reason to lie to anybody or anyone. Because personally, I would not care to be the rarest. I would not care to be the most common. I got O blood. I got, I got, I think I got O negative. I know O something. I got O blood. I got some regular blood. You don't, you don't see me going around saying I got AB blood, uh, B negative, AB negative. What's the point of lying? Like that, see, that's, that's, okay. Well, another thing, nothing, nothing gets me. <sighs> I wouldn't say it wouldn't get me aggravated, but the one thing that the one thing that uh gets me the most is when a person that don't even know themselves try to tell me what I am. And I like like I like shorty fix your depression first. Like fix your life first. I'll do. I say it because that's what I truly believe. Not I wouldn't even say believe anymore. That's what I truly know for a fact. Fact. Months of thinking, over 50,000 videos of MBTI watched of every MBTI type. A to do all this research, especially all that research, just a lie about a stupid, I won't say stupid, but about a goofy personality type. I do not care what personality type I am. I don't. It just so happens that I'm an INFJ. So happens. If someone's people in the MBTI community would say I'm not a nine of J but purely and it don't even be valid reasons. It just be subjective thoughts because they don't want me to be an I of J for whatever reason. I'm I'm t I'm, t I'm telling you, I'm telling you, the reason the reason people told me I I'm not an I of J is so is so close minded. Yeah. 
It's a reason why I stay away from the MBTI community. Y'all close-minded, and if someone don't do something you like or your way or outside of your perspective, they cannot be an INFJ. If INFJ is the rarest personality, they're not going to fit your perspective in general. You don't know the perspective because... <sighs> okay. I'm going I'm to I'm just say this right quick before I get into the list. How how can you say INFJ has the best chameleon like effect than just tell someone they don't look like an INFJ because they don't appear like an INFJ? You 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 see how you contradict yourselves? Do y'all see how y'all contradict yourself? Contradict yourself. Y'all say INFJ can fit into any social setting. They're like chameleons. Hey, I'm an INFJ. You don't look like an INFJ. You just contradicted yourself. Congratulations. Congratulations. Someone said I wasn't an INFJ because I was very talented. Um, first of all, I was I I was naturally gifted at being good at a lot of stuff. I did I did I did not even have to try to be good at something. I understood. I learned quick. I learned extremely quick. Extremely quick. Extremely fast. There was a time I went to a uh, summer camp, right? And these guys from Maryland, lacrosse players, awesome lacrosse players. I learned how to be just as good as them in about three hours of playing lacrosse with them. I'm extremely good at learning. Extremely good. Um, someone said, um, I can't be an INFJ because I can write. I, I'm good at making music. Um, I've been writing poetry, songs, and books since before I got into elementary school. I'm sure, I'm sure that's something that I am sure I, I've been writing I've been writing anything, books, poetry, songs, you name it, since before elementary school. And, and the thing about a lot of these assumptions is y'all y'all say it, y'all y'all say these assumptions, but never get to know the person. My funny thing is, funny thing is a lot a lot of people that say they're INFJs. Will say all this stuff, all this stuff about INFJs when they say they're INFJ, and contradict it throughout their whole normal, throughout their whole normal cognition. I got, I got, I got tricks to put people back in their normal cognitive functions. I got tricks for that. I got tricks for that. Y'all act. I see. I see through it. <laughs> Y'all are obvious to me. Y'all obvious to me. I'm digging in that ass, boy. <laughs> Media. Um, one of my goals in life was to travel a lot, and that's what I did because I wanted to travel. Life is too short not to do what you want to do. Um, people add me because when I dress up, I can be cute. It's as simple as that, and I don't go out my way to talk to people. People come to me. People come to me. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But I'm not surrounded. I'm not surrounded by people all the time. Cause that's that shit is exhausting. Very. Unless unless you're my best friend, best friend. <laughs> I like joking with y'all, man. I like joking with y'all. But unless you're my best friend, I will get tired of you real quick. I don't get tired of people. That's my love. I simply don't. I can, but it takes a it it the cool time the cool down timer for someone to actually consider my friend, which it takes a long time to be like my friend friend instead of an acquaintance. But the cool for y'all y'all con y'all contradict yourself the whole time. Y'all say y'all love INFJs and when y'all meet a real INFJ, 
y'all battered them. It, it like it literally like, is literally like what people did to Jesus. They didn't believe that he was this, so they battered him. That's literally what I and J go through with this whole MBTI community. They didn't believe that he was this, so they batter him. That's literally what I and J go through with this whole MBTI community. You can crucify all you want. You can have your own subjective thoughts. That's fine, but that do not change the fact that that person is an INFJ. It, it, it doesn't. It doesn't. INFJs. That, that's what they say, so-called said. Y'all don't like meeting INFJs? Because when you meet one, you think of every reason under the book to say why that person not an INFJ. That's the same way uh, when Jesus said he was the son of God, they, they gave every reason under the book to say he wasn't. Jesus said he was the son of God. They they gave every reason under the book to say he wasn't. And you know why Jesus wasn't moved? Because he know he was. I'm not moved. Because I know I am an INFJ. Is is it it pretty pretty straightforward, simple as that. You can call me stubborn all you want. You can throw all your subjective reasons. And the thing about your subjective reason, your subjective reason in any debate is not meant, like this game y'all play is not meant. I said this so many times, but the games y'all play is not meant for me to win. I'm not trying to win nothing. I'm giving you the truth and you're trying to cloud it. I mean, we fly high, no lie. You know this. All it. <laughs> but if one of us goes in, then we all go through it. Sing it. Now he knocked out. If Drizzy got the money, then Drizzy gonna pay him. Those my brothers I ain't even gotta say it. It's just something they know. They know. They know. They know. Hey. Then, oh, this, this is my favorite part. When when they don't believe I, when they don't believe I'm not an INFJ, they go ahead and make a video about it and throw shade and subconscious, not not subconscious. They they throw a little shade on the low at you and act like you won't notice you throwing shade. Don't do that. Don't do that. Why? You want to feel cute for the moment? Okay. 50, you get paid. How much money you got to do that? Zero? Zero? Wow. Look at you go. Zero? Zero? Wow. Look at you go. But well, anyway, soul is ugly. It doesn't matter how cute you are physically. You're still going to be ugly, you feel me? Oh, no, 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 no. Have a great day.